righty. This is March the 10th. And we are heading out to the fuel dock. We're going to take on about 60 gallons of fuel. And uh, got the engine is rebuilt and running, so we're just happy as could be. We're heading out uh, through San Pedro Channel here. About mid throttle, she's pushing about five knots, so that's a good thing. really need you up here because wind's going to be pushing us away from the dock so we'll need to hop off and uh, go ahead and undo the lifeline on this side so you're ready and then uh, we need to jump off and right by the edge so you can grab it and I'll come in kind of bow first up against towards the docks It does, but it's, I think it's real slow. So, so maybe we can get some in the other tank.
Yeah, the, uh, we got probably 40-ish gallons on board total, 30 and 10. Uh, starboard tank is completely full. The port tank has about a half full. We managed to get a half full before it started acting stupid. Make sure that our running tanks are in fact on. We got a little bit of traffic. Don't worry about these two power boats. They're going ahead. Yeah. Uh, Pedro Hill in the evening, the sun has just gone down. You've got all these restaurants and party places up and down here. And as you as we motor past, it never fails that the breeze coming off of San Pedro Hill blows all of those all the food smells over to the boat. And we go back to the hungry the marina hungry. Actually, he is pulling off to the port side. Looks like he's leaving the, uh, he's going off on one of the little side tributaries. It's cold. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's supposed to get into the 50s down here and it's just a little breeze still. Yep. Next weekend. Sounds good. San Pedro.